Oh, sure. Maybe like share what you guys do. Oh, yeah. You like the sliders and these robots? Yeah, so we're a, we're a cinema robotics company. Okay. Um, our main mission is uh, creating advanced robotic systems at reasonable prices. Okay, uh, awesome. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and we try to bring a lot of, uh, you know, the, the, the big studio technologies at lower cost. So over here we have um, a virtual production setup. So Unreal Engine is running on this laptop. Mm -hmm. And uh, our system is then relaying the data from um, itself to our custom Unreal Engine plugin. Okay. And so as the physical camera moves around, so does the virtual camera. Mm -hmm. um, and then what we see is uh, what the virtual camera sees. Okay. So you can get a tabletop virtual production setup um, very easily and at very low cost. Okay. And so that, that system is available for purchase. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, uh, it's under $3,000 for that combination. Um, you mean like the slider in the head? Yep, yeah, slider in the head. Okay. Um, and uh, in all the software, there's things like uh, networkability. You can play, mess around with Python and okay. uh, the SDK if you want to. Um, you can also do uh, a lot of AI-related things, so automatic reframing. Uh, that's a part of the software. And uh, and yes, some people buy just the pan tilt heads. Uh, some people do pan tilt slide. I mean like about the software so you can also do all the stuff in your maybe like <laughs> is there any demo like your software uh, yeah yeah so it's right there like uh Let's check it out to see, but like, uh, that's our software okay got right? it so it's a web app yeah, yeah. oh got the it. device will host that web app okay and then from the web app you can configure everything okay. uh, how the device is moving uh where it is precisely and a couple of other um you know bells and whistles and about the keyframes i mean like can we just uh set the keyframe manually with our hands or like we need to go into the yeah, you can but most people don't like that oh. um, so and that's because you can't get precise uh, positioning oh. uh, there is a joystick like that comes with the device sort of like a PlayStation controller okay. and there you can very easily uh, get uh, the, you know so just you can very easily set the start and stop positions okay and how about that little jibs yeah so the goal here is to make a system um that competes with the robotic arm so it yeah. looks like a jig but it's much more like a robotic arm okay. um in terms of precision smoothness and uh, speed mm -hmm. and so this is a prototype but the the eventual goal is uh, we will have a system um, that can go at those speeds, mm -hmm. um, but be a fraction of the cost. Okay. The the, the cheapest arm is probably about like uh, eighty thousand dollars. Yep. Uh, we want to make a we want to make a device that is uh, you know a fraction of that, so we're aiming for seven thousand. Okay. Right. And uh, typically to rent one is like twenty thousand. Okay. Right. So uh, that's what we're doing there, and it'll have all of the same things that we have in that system. Just with the more range of freedom more, yeah. exactly more range um and more that more domains of freedom okay a uh, really difficult like project but like it's been fun yeah because uh, we do, we're, we're a small team like four or five guys okay and so we do all of the engineering all the software development yeah you guys are awesome <laughs> uh, yeah we're trying man yeah, we're trying um uh, is, is it okay if i grab your email and then we oh, can sure, keep you sure. updated or like scan the badge we haven't been scanning the badges because it's expensive. We have to pay NAB. Oh my God. Yeah, so, oh we're, no. just, so we're just collecting uh, everyone's Okay, emails. sure, sure, sure. No problem. Like one, two, three. One, two, three. Nope. Cheap. And gmail.com. Also, the badge. If you scan it, you need to pay an AB. Yeah. Oh, oh you got to pay an AB for everything. <laughs> yeah. The chairs, the TV, everything. Okay. Yeah, keep on doing. Cool, thank you. <laughs> thank it was you, nice talking you. to you. And like, maybe buy your stuff in the future. No, like, yeah, yeah, these are awesome. Yeah, I'll let you know when it's available. I'll shoot, shoot over an email. Um, okay. And then, yeah, definitely. Oh, so these are already out? These are available. Okay. Yeah, so this on our website, exevo.com, you can go and purchase. Okay. And that includes, uh, again, like the, the tracking software um, and the virtual production software. So what are those antennas for? 
those oh. are wireless yeah cool. so the the uh, there's a couple of ways you can communicate with the device it'll host an access point and with the wi-fi that yeah can, it'll so. host a wi-fi okay. access point you can connect to that um or you can connect it to your wi-fi okay or you can wire it up through ethernet okay right so again a, d a couple of different ways to interface with the device and also how to power it just with dc npf or, or npf batteries okay So it, it's a pin tail tailed. Yep. Oh, so, yeah, okay. And then tilt. Is it, are you guys working on a maybe like bigger, bigger head, that kind of stuff? Because- Like the professional cameras? I mean, like sometimes you need something like maybe like follow focus that kind of stuff and add a bunch of stuff on there i mean like it will be kind of heavy hey, the heavy isn't really a problem because this can go up to 10 15 kg okay um so <laughs> like you know uh 20 to 30 pounds okay um and so we haven't had issues regarding weight okay um so this is not the weight limit so you can definitely put a much heavier system on oh this. definitely Okay, I think that's it. Cool. Yeah, thanks. Nice thanks. Thanks. You.